Hey everyone, welcome back to Factic. I'm Barry Alex, and today, we're diving into the latest leaks and rumors surrounding NVIDIA's upcoming powerhouse, the GeForce 5090. This next-gen graphics card is set to take gaming and performance benchmarks to a whole new level, with whispers of groundbreaking specs and features. If you're a gamer, a content creator, or just an enthusiast eager to see what NVIDIA has in store, this is one to watch. In this video, we'll be breaking down all the leaked details, expected performance gains, rumor design upgrades, and what these advancements could mean for the future of gaming and professional workstations. For more details, check the links in the description below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more updates on the latest tech. So, without further ado, let's jump into everything we know about the NVIDIA GeForce 5090. Let's start with the release timing. Although NVIDIA hasn't confirmed a release date, the most consistent rumors point to late 2024 or early 2025. This timing follows NVIDIA's typical 18 to 24 month cycle. However, the 5090 might not be the first Blackwell GPU. The RTX 5080 is rumored to launch first, possibly at CES 2025. So, we could see both cards revealed together, even if they don't hit shelves simultaneously. Now let's talk architecture. The 5090 is expected to be built on NVIDIA's Blackwell architecture, replacing the current Ada Lovelace architecture. Blackwell is anticipated to boost both performance and efficiency, a major advantage considering the 5090's expected high power demands. Although exact details aren't confirmed, Blackwell's upgrades are expected to include better core efficiency and potential architectural changes that can optimize power usage and temperature control. Here's an interesting bit. There's talk about a multi-chiplet module, or MCM, design. AMD and Intel already use MCM to boost processing power. And while some leaks suggest NVIDIA may follow suit, it may only apply to the commercial-grade Blackwell GPUs. If it makes it to the 5090, though, this could be a game-changer for handling multiple tasks efficiently and boosting overall performance. Now on to specs. Based on current rumors, the 5090 could feature a 448-bit memory bus with 28 gigabytes of GDDR7VRAM, providing about 33% faster memory speeds compared to the 4090. Such power means the 5090 should handle even the most demanding graphics and AI tasks with ease. But keep in mind, this boost in performance comes with a price, around 40% more power consumption than the 4090, so a high wattage power supply may be necessary for this upgrade. In terms of raw performance, the 5090 is expected to deliver significant improvements over the 4090, rumored to be up to 1.7 times faster. Even with a boost somewhere between 1.5x to 1.6x, this performance leap is massive. The 5090's rumored 30% higher base clock speed should make games and applications run faster and smoother, making it one of the most powerful GPUs available. If these performance numbers hold, the 5090 could set a new standard for flagship GPUs. Cooling is another area of interest. Despite its power demands, there are hints that the RTX 5090 might actually be slimmer than the 4090. NVIDIA may be working on advanced cooling solutions to handle the increased heat while maintaining a compact design. If successful, this would make the 5090 a more accessible upgrade for users concerned about GPU size and fit. For gamers, the 5090's upgraded GDDR7 memory and additional CUDA cores should mean top-tier 4K gaming performance, possibly even 8K at ultra settings. Ray tracing should also see improvements, with faster memory and an updated architecture making effects like lifelike lighting and reflections even smoother. In addition to gaming, the 5090 might excel in AI-powered features, like DLSS 4.0, a potential new iteration of NVIDIA's DLSS upscaling tech. This could mean sharper and more detailed visuals even at lower resolutions, along with reduced GPU load, which translates into higher frame rates. If DLSS 4.0 meets expectations, the 5090 might become the go-to GPU for high-end gaming and visual quality. Finally, let's cover price and availability. Right now, the RTX 5090 is expected to cost around $1,500 or more, similar to the 4090's launch price. Availability may be limited, especially if Nvidia prioritizes AI GPUs, but the card should stay within the premium range. 
prices could fluctuate depending on demand and regional variations. And these are the leaks of upcoming NVIDIA GoFor RTX 5090. If you want more information about this GPU, you will find the links in the description below. And if you found this video useful, then like the video and also hit that subscribe button. And if you have any question or suggestion for our next comparison or review, feel free to comment below. Until then, goodbye and take care.